All right, welcome to markubon.com. And what I'm going to show to you today is exactly how to uh, view your source code uh, in an HTML file that you want to add to your WordPress blog. If you host it, uh, this is exactly what you're going to want to do. Uh, as I mentioned in the uh, in the blog itself, what you'll want to do is create your brand with a landing page. So if you have affiliate programs, what you can do is kind of self-cloak your own links, your affiliate IDs and your own links so that you not only are promoting yourself, uh, you are also protecting your affiliate links. Now, you can see this being done in things like Wicked Traffic uh, or Viral URL where it's cloaking the link and protecting your affiliate ID, but it's still pointing these people to specific landing pages that you uh, will create for yourself through your affiliate programs. Now, uh, what I'm going to do in this example is show you uh, where to find the source code for something like Black Belt Recruiting. And I already logged in. I have my Black Belt Recruiting landing page up already. When you look at a screen like this, it's going to be the Internet Explorer version. I've noticed that it actually hides the menu bar but if you hit the alt key it shows you that menu bar right here at the top now it's a very simple process all you gotta do is hit view go down to source and click that that source I got two of them open actually I'll shut this one down um, that source will pop up right here now this is the exact HTML code um, that is linked to my black belt recruiting landing page now as I mentioned also in the blog I know that this is my affiliate link because it has my affiliate ID right here my username in this case right there so that is essentially uh, how to find the HTML source code I know that was really stupid easy but you know I'm here to show you all the simple things so that you can evolve into the type of marketer that you want to be so what I'm going to show you now is what I'm going to do with this. You see, when you create landing pages that are affiliated with your, with your blog, it's not that simple. You can't just copy and paste it into your, um, your directory, your subdirectory. And if you don't know how to do that, there's also a video link to that. But if you want to link it to your subdirectory, you can't just copy it in. You've got to do a couple of steps. So what I'm going to show you is how to do that exactly here. So what you want to do is you want to go to File uh, or Edit, Copy, Edit, Select All, Copy, Open Up, Notepad, and you can paste it. So you can either right-click Paste or Edit, Paste and it's going to copy and paste that HTML code right there. Uh, so what you'll want to do is you want to do a file save. Usually do, I usually do a file save as so I know where the heck all these things are going. I'm just going to save it to my desktop um, as all files. Uh, I'm going to save it as a uh, htm file I believe that works. There are different file extensions. I'm not a technical guy. It, it works when I do HTM or HTML. Um, so I'm not a technical guy. If you're a technical person, you're watching this, maybe you can explain to me what the difference is. I believe it has something to do with how the, the code itself is written and how it will function in different browsers and, and I don't know what. but usually if you save it like that to your desktop it'll save it as an HTML file and I totally saved it incorrectly um, oh, let me cancel that sorry about that give me just a second here as I rename this file uh, black belt recruiting okay so what I'm going to do now is since I have it saved, this is essentially the screen that I saved. Now I showed you before how to 
um, create a subdirectory. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my GoDaddy account, and I'm going to upload this into my subdirectory. And I will show you what I'm going to do here. Just log into your GoDaddy account or your hosted your hosted server account. Log in. And GoDaddy's always nice and slow for us click on your blog which for me is markubon.com click on hosting which is this right here and I'm just gonna speed through all this stuff because I already uh, spoke on this in my last video you can find that here on my my blog so once you get into this hosting control center click on your files it's gonna pull up my file manager now I believe in my last video I set up a uh, yes I did I set up a directory right here so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click this directory and I'm gonna upload yeah, see the folder contains no files or subfolders, so I'm going to upload my file that I just saved. Browse. It's on my desktop. Um, you know, I'm going to actually rename this one more time. Um, BB. Uh, Actually, screw it. Let's just leave it like this. Click upload. Upload successful. So, what I'm going to do now is I will show you what I just did. So, once my tab opens up, Can open up. Sorry if I jump around. I do that. Um, belts. In this case, sensitive. B L C K B L T. And then black belt rec. Boom. See how see how simple that is. Now what I had just in, in essence done was I linked my landing page to my website. So now when I go out and I promote this link, I'm not, now no offense to Mike Dillard, but I'm not promoting magnetic sponsoring anymore per se. I'm promoting Mark Rubon with a resource called Black Belt Recruiting. It just so happens to be an affiliate program that Mike Dillard offers. Uh, and I stand behind black belt recruiting 110%. You get more out of it than just how to recruit. You you learn about how to speak to other people really is what it comes down to. And if you don't know how to speak to other people, you're dead in the water. But uh, that is essentially what I'm going to do with an HTML code. Now you can do that with essentially everything online. Uh, load You can load anything like this. Uh, there are some technical things that you need to be aware of. I'm not that guy, but if you search around the internet, you will be able to find that resource. If you have any questions, you can contact me, support at markubon.com, or you can go ahead and uh, just leave me a post, a comment on the blog, and I will talk to you soon. Have a great day.